the last flight of the aircraft that was critical in India's victory of 1965 and 1971. Nostalgia was the core of the afternoon at the Kalaikonda Air Base where the fighter jets type 77 of MiG-21 were phased out or retired after 50 years of service. How pivotal the Type 77 MiG was to our fighter fleet can be gauged by the fact that 80% of our fighter pilots have flown this version of the MiG-21. The MiG, before gaining notoriety as the flying coffin, did have its glory days. By the end of the 1971 war with Pakistan, the MiG had claimed two F-16s, one Sabre, one Hercules and four star fighters of the Pakistani Air Force. In the Eastern Theater, it was the MiG that carried out the pinpoint attack on the governor's house at Dhaka. Commanders swear by the MiG-21's agility, quick turnaround and acceleration, which is why the MiG was fielded in the Kargil War too. The last 15 of these cigar-shaped, single-seater, single-engine fighters at the OCU named Young Ones were being used to train rookie pilots. As it was towed back into the hangar today, men who had hailed the dawn of the supersonics with its arrival in 1963 teared up. After all, five generations of pilots have cut their proverbial teeth aboard this Soviet era plane, which has been their life and its memories. In New Delhi, this is Nandita Dagar for DD News.